figured I'd do a quick how-to video on how to fix up some of these uh, crate knobs and uh, lots of PV stuff used it back in the day was like the classic 50 triple X stuff like that they use these four and a half millimeter or three sixteenths inch diameter knurled shafts it's real hard to find uh, cool knobs or replacement knobs for those um, this one specifically has a very annoying knob set up where it's got like a uh, 3 8 diameter hole in the center then it uses this little piece you know I guess that's so this could be a universal knob and they would just make different centers to pop in and for different size shafts which makes sense but they fall apart yeah try to work on an amp pull the knobs off these break off you got to glue them back on or they just generally fall off on their own um, yeah and then trying to find a replacement 3 16 knob is a bitch plus these things weigh a fucking ton and they look like shit the the knurls aren't sharp it just looks like a crappy freaking knob you know it weighs a ton this amp already weighs like a hundred fucking pounds and it's got five pounds worth of knobs on it so we're ditching those I went ahead and ordered from uh, PV's parts department some of these little mini chicken heads these are on like the uh, PV 6505 112 combo the uh, little uh, 6505 mini amp stuff like that and this is about perfect for this amp um, Although, you'll see that this knob is for a flatted shaft, which isn't a big deal. It basically fits on there pretty good. You can get it to slip. What we're going to do is make this to where it actually fits a knurled shaft right on the money. How we do that is, we take a little oil, not much, just put a drop on the end of that shaft. Then we take some heat shrink tubing. This is probably 3 16 I think. Clip it just so it's a little bit longer than the length of the shaft. Go ahead and slide that onto your shaft that you just put some oil onto. Push it all the way up to about a millimeter from it's touching the pot. Use a heat gun. Not a lighter. I use a lighter though. Go ahead and heat that heat shrink up. Spin it around. Shrink the other side. Then let that cool. Go ahead and index your knob. Just kind of get it to where you a mark on there where it goes. Just take some super glue. Here we're using some Gorilla Glue. It's kind of a gel thing. Just put one drop. Hi, baby. Then just take your knob. Slide it right on there. Push it all the way up. Push it up solid. Then let that sit for about five minutes. Yeah. Hey, will you take this in there and put it in the trash for me? Please. Will I finish up, babe? Thank you. Then we'll let that sit for about five minutes or whatever your glue normally takes. This glue takes about five minutes, I think, to completely set up. And then, here's one I've already done. Since you oiled that shaft up, it'll slide right off. There's your heat shrink. All fitted to the splines and glued to the inside of the knob. And Did you put it in the trash? Thank you. And it's solid. It won't strip. And it comes right off again when you need to. Hey, what? I want cookie. You can't have a cookie. But there we go. Easy fixing. Hope that helps some people.